seen all of that but I'm ready to start my day it is 7 40 I have to be at work or I have to be on my computer at 8 30 so I still have some time to just chill um, you also just saw me wrote, writing my to-do list for the day and you guys saw the top three pasted everywhere it's literally my theme for right now top three get that done and make you feel productive so you're welcome to a new vlog okay I put a little Bobbiana in my hair yesterday. I had it in curls, and um, I love it in curls. But it's work week, so I just decided to, you know, do some bob fitting for the work, and also put some flip over curls in the front because that's my vibe. I like me a little curtain situation. Like I like me a little bang in the front, you know, a little situation like that. <laughs> So yeah, I just have that and I feel cute. I love how it looks But I just wanted to say good morning I wanted to start off the vlog and you know Just say thank you guys so much for your support every time I think that I don't say it's enough that um, when I do my videos I think I don't see like subscribe all of that, but you guys are always still here supporting liking and I'm so grateful for all of you but with that being said, I just want to say that please like the videos um, when you watch them. Give them a huge thumbs up because YouTube literally looks at stuff like that, okay? So please give the video a huge thumbs up. Don't forget it. I know because I forget, you might forget too. So because I forget, it's my fault, okay? So I'm here to tell you that always give the video a huge thumbs up, um, all the videos that you watch on the channel. And then also leave a comment, you know, all of that stuff definitely leaves, um, helps the channel to grow. So we're trying to grow. We're trying to hit 2,000 subscribers right now. So let's get it, okay? And yeah, it's a new week today. Uh, I'm just gonna work. I honestly don't know, like, I don't have any other plans, okay? I'm just gonna work and edit. I have contents that I have to post, so I will just work on that and go along with the day. I also wanna film a fitness vlog today. So I think on the weekly vlog, you guys might not see me too much today because I will be on my fitness vlog trying to curate some fitness content for you guys because it's been a long time i haven't filmed fitness content in a long time and i think a lot of people like that and i like the comments that i get on my fitness vlogs you know it's inspiring i like to see that what i'm doing is inspiring other women so if you don't watch my fitness content you're missing out okay i have a whole weighing vlog that i do every now and then to update you guys on what my fitness journey is looking like and all of that so definitely check it out because i'm filming another one today um but yeah happy monday happy new week i hope that you like this week's vlog i i promise okay that this week is going to be better because i've been a bad vlogger over the past few weeks and i accept that but i promise to be better this week so i'm gonna go work and i will see you guys when i see you all right hey guys happy tuesday it is tuesday today the 22nd um i'm literally just getting out of work and coming on my last break for the day and i have a few packages i just thought i'll unbox that with you so 
let's see what we have because I don't wanna I don't want to waste all my break <laughs> okay I'm excited about this one so the first thing that I have here is creatine oh! um, but if you're into fitness then you probably already know what creatine is this is a dietary supplement um, for people who work out you need to have a fitness routine okay um, but this on training days is going to help you boost your energy it helps you with you know lean muscle recovery and all of that all of the good stuff I've never really tried um, supplements before this is my first time this is going to be my first time so I will be trying this out I will give you guys updates as to how it goes as how my body is working with it and whatnot I was very skeptical okay about um, taking supplements in general as a fitness girly but Creatine is science backed. It's like proven. Okay, it's it's been proven so many times, and it's the one. It's I, I see that it's the one supplement that a lot of people still talk about. So yeah, I decided that I was going to try creatine. So I'll tell you guys how it goes. Um, how it goes. I honestly will update you guys on how it goes and let you guys know if there's anything else you need to know. <laughs> But the next thing that I have here is a dress. This is a really cute dress. I will show you guys a little later. Maybe when I close from work. It's um, um, a jumpsuit. But it's short. And it's nice. And the fabric. And I love the color. It's lightweight. I'm hoping that the picture is exactly what it looks like. Because then I would really like it. But this is pretty much everything that we have for today's delivery. It's only two items that I have. I'm going to jump right back into work. And I guess I'll see you guys when I'm done. Because I got to go. Okay. So I just got out of work. It's currently 5.21. Um, I'm out of work. Everything is okay. Okay. Um, what I'm about to do right now is I'm about to make dinner. I'm thinking of making pasta um, and some veggies. So I'll just make that with you guys. But let me show you guys again. I was showing you this, which is the creatine. This is um, the creatine food supplements that I got it says here that it's good for strength and endurance I used to be very skeptical I was saying that I was very skeptical um, about trying any type of supplement so I really don't the only one I do is my protein powder and then now this creatine so this would be the only two supplements that I take in terms of being fit because I always said to myself that I, bless you mama bless you I always said to myself that I mm -hmm. Um, I didn't want anything like influencing my fitness in the sense that I didn't want anything to be the reason why I am like looking bulky or looking fit. I wanted to actually work out for it and I have done so. If you watch my fitness vlog, my most recent fitness vlog, yes ma'am. If you've watched my, <laughs> you just wanted to, <laughs> you just wanted to show your thumb on camera. <laughs> You're so sweet. Um, if you watch my most recent fitness vlog, <laughs> if you've watched my most recent fitness vlog, you would know that I have lost a lot of weight, and you know the bulkiness is beginning to come around. You know, just tiny bits and pieces here and there, but I like it, um, and I'm happy about it. So I'm looking forward to what this will do. This is supposed to help with. Um, strength and endurance. I think I've already said that, but they also mentioned that it helps with if you like deal with joint pain um, after your workout. My my neck is always sore when I work out. Like my back, lower back pain, insane. I know that lower back pain is associated to when you're like growing or after you have kids, but I think that the way my lower back pain be rocking me sometimes is crazy. So. I'm just hoping that this helps with all of that and I'll give you guys updates in future vlogs but for right now creatine is here and yeah that's just what it is let's get into making dinner it's 5 24 I want to make um, I want to make dinner fast enough so I can just go and work out and just chill for the evening okay let me just say that um, while I was working today I was watching you know a few other things on YouTube and whatnot and I was just saying to myself that I think I need to hone into my soft girl era I think I'm naturally a soft girl don't get me wrong but I'm also very like a go-getter because I've always had to like fight for my things I've always had to like chase my own stuff if you get what I'm saying I've always had to like struggle to get my own thing so naturally I 
have the demeanor of someone who's always like on the fence like someone who's always ready for action and i like that but i also think that i'm ready to go into my soft girl self you know i'm just ready to relax a lot more breathe a lot more be calm a lot more and just hone into that feminine um, aspect of my life and I, I, I mean thinking about it I feel like it's something that I already do but Loki I feel like I could do more is what I'm saying okay Loki I feel like I could do more I feel like I could be more softer as a woman <laughs> I don't know I don't know if it makes sense but it's just what I feel it's just what I feel like so a few things that I am intending or like planning on implementing into my lifestyle is um, you know just being extremely she says I shouldn't talk okay he says I shouldn't talk <laughs> but guys I will we'll get into all of that maybe later in the evening when I'm doing my nighttime skincare or anytime later but I'm just ready to like hone into my more softer feminine side I think I already have that but I think I want to be like go into it more and just be more calm and not always be like ready to go like you know just see life or approach life in a much more calmer calmer approach you know yeah i think i want to yes see what you want to say okay not you picking your nose on camera <laughs> you're doing your nose on camera okay so we gotta go now um but it's time to make some dinner so I hope that you guys enjoy cooking with me. <laughs> I'm about to work out um, I'm done cooking dinner I just haven't eaten yet because I want to work out before I um, have some food I'm currently drinking my protein plus the creatine I'm excited I'm excited to see um, you know what work it does but today is upper body day core days and upper body days are the worst for me it takes a lot for me to push through those days because it's just a lot but um hopefully it starts to pay off soon because upper body is just it kills me it literally kills me but let's get some upper body workout done i don't know if i'm gonna record that i don't know i might take some steps with my phone and just show you with that because um i like to include my workouts videos in my fitness vlog so hello <laughs> so um, i'll just put some excerpts here for you guys to see but it's time to work out hey guys <laughs> happy friday let me make sure that you guys can actually see me right happy friday um i got out of work not so long ago and i figured i'll pick you guys up because i didn't see you yesterday i think the whole of yesterday i didn't see you and i'm in my bathroom yes i am in my bathroom okay but um it is friday 
fun Friday, okay? I am feeling a little, um, I'm PMSing, so the hormones are all over the place, so I'm just overly exhausted. And guys, let's, let's, let's take a second to talk about, because we're literally talking about it in my meeting, and you know, my, my supervisor was saying that if, you know, the, <laughs> let me say it well, so my supervisor was saying that the lower back pain that you get when you're getting close to 30 or when you're above 30 is a thing. And immediately when he said this, I'm like, oh my God, I have been dealing with the worst lower back pain for just the f past few weeks now. And I honestly thought it was something that it was temporal. It was going to go away. I mean, I still think that it's going to go away, but it's been around for a few weeks. Okay. It's, I'm, it's been around for a few weeks and it's just not doing it and the days that i'm pmsing is a lot it's like my lower back right here at the back of my waist is just crazy pain and immediately when he said that it hit me because it looks like i'm not the only one i might not be the only one a lot of other people feel the same way and then he said that at a point you realize that it never goes away and then you come to realize that that's what your life is going to be and i'm like oh is that what my life is going to be? Because I don't want to have lower back pain forever. Like, oh, it's literally so crazy. It makes me so tired of sitting. And my job requires that I sit the whole day. So, yeah. But anyway, enough of that, okay? Enough of the health talk. But it's Friday. Um, it's 7.30 right now. I am about to make Indomie. If you're from Ghana, you know what Indomie is. If you're from Nigeria, Ghana, all of that, you probably already know what Indomie is. Um, but if you're here, Indomie is just noodles, okay? Noodles made Ghana way. Noodles made African style. I don't know if it's every African country that does this, but we do it. Nigerians do it as well. So that's what I'm making today. Now, I haven't had Indomie for the longest time. Matter of fact, I stopped having that type of noodles because um, there was just a lot of talks about it and how unhealthy it could be and yada yada but also generally um i figured that i would cut away a lot of things from my diet since i was stepping into my fitness phase so a lot of things like soda sugary stuff i just cut them off i am a huge juicer so that's why i make my own juices at home um but i'm not gonna lie i have ju days that i drink you know store-bought juice um, but majority of the times I'm very conscious of like juices and soda soda I don't even drink soda at all like I cut soda off occasionally I would have soda with a pizza or something but it's not a habit it's not something that I drink maybe out of the whole month I would drink soda like once and I'm very proud of myself because I used to be an avid soda drinker like I would drink soda every single day I literally would go through a full bottle by myself mm. I had such an addiction and it should tell you even the way I said mm, should tell you but anyway I stopped all of that so it's been a long time and yesterday when I um I said I went to buy a few things and then I, I'm like you know what let me just grab this I am craving it I haven't had it in a long time and I think I'm gonna make it so that's what we're gonna make today I'm gonna make that for hubby and myself for dinner and then I'll just make some um cereal from from Papa for dinner but yeah so let's get into making dinner and then we can talk a little later.
Okay guys, happy Saturday. Good morning. Um, we have a few errands to run. I have to go to the post office to send something out to my big sister. And then I am gonna go to Dollar General to buy some detergent. Ah, I literally just came down the stairs, but let's go, okay? It's nice outside, it's not so warm. Um, it rained all day last night, all day yesterday. Um, so it's pretty cool today, but yeah. show you guys the things that I picked up I have some wipes and then I also got some candles I got this particular um, scent because I figured it it looked a little like fall I kind of want to start to bring in the fall mood into the house so um, yes and then I have this small spaces um, air freshener I'm gonna put this in the bathroom so that should be nice I also got some fresh kitchen towels the, one that I, the ones that I have are so old and a little crusty. I'm even ashamed to show them. Um, I mean, I'm not going to show them, but yeah, I got new ones. So that. And then I also got this for the toilet bowl. I always put this in my toilet seat. I mean, my toilet um, situation. And then it gives you that. I'm sure you guys already know what this is. Um, and then I got some fabric refreshness for laundry. And then um, this for cleaning the bathroom. And then some sponge, metal sponges. And then I also had to re-up on my sanitary towels because a woman is always going to be a woman, okay? And yeah, and then I also got some diaper from for in front of her. Um, but this is pretty much it. I honestly just had to go. Uh, my hair looks a little messy, but whatever. Uh, but I had to go and send some things out to my sister, so I had that done. And I'm happy because during the week I had barely have any time to do that. I close at five, and the post office closes at four, so I couldn't do it during the week. So I had to do it today, and I had to go because they were closing in like 30 minutes. So I'm happy that I caught them fast. Um, but honestly, let me try to set you guys up here, if that helps. You guys are literally sitting on my toaster, so. I'm just hoping that it's nice and it doesn't fall off but um, it's Saturday okay and the agenda for today matter of fact the agenda for today and tomorrow um, today I'm just doing house chores this is what I do right now kind of my Saturdays are looking like house chores cooking meal prepping and then on Sundays I create content I just batch create you guys probably already know that um, but that's how I'm able to get content to post during the week because during the week I, I don't film any content okay except if I who is that um so on Sundays I just create content batch create so that I have content and then um, on Saturdays I just do house chores um tidy up the house you know sometimes i do it on friday night just so that saturdays i can chill um but i don't really have much to do today i'm not gonna lie i just have to cook um and then i'm also thinking of cleaning the bathroom because it's something that i have to do so i will do that and then i have to edit this vlog that you guys are watching um and i'm thinking maybe later i might film an episode of bed you know maybe sort out my hair um and then film an episode of bed but i also have to wash my hair 
because my hair hasn't been washed in like three weeks so I have to wash it and treat it so that might be done today or tomorrow but honestly my weekend is just looking like house chores um, chilling I'm thinking of doing maybe a little bit of a painting situation this evening I think I've been saying that or I've been wanting to do that for a while I have the paint brushes the boards and everything because I picked them up a while ago and they're still sitting here and I haven't used them so I might do that tonight with my husband I don't know um, but today's this weekend is just really a chill weekend content house chores and then next week we go back into work week and I see I don't have much to do and then self-care as well my hair my nails all of that so um yeah I'm just gonna get into cooking right now today what I'm cooking I'm thinking of making I, I know I can think of making I've already I've already defrosted my pork ribs so I definitely will make some ribs and I've made ribs with you guys um, in like my last two vlogs that stuff tastes so good so I'm like you know what I think I'm a ribs girly I love me some ribs and I'm gonna make it at home you guys already know I'm always cooking at home um, so I'm gonna make some ribs with some mashed potato tonight for dinner I think that's nice and warm and like you know perfect for the weather that we have today and I'm thinking of making some jollof rice to put down for in front of pack because last weekend I made her contemporary and she had that over the course of the week with you know a bunch of other stuff so I'm thinking maybe jollof rice jollof rice is not <laughs> jollof rice is not so versatile so when I make jollof rice for her I have to still make something maybe mashed potato she's currently um, she eats everything so you know she eats baby food fruits pureed um and then for african food i think she's still getting used to it she's a good african child i'm not even going to lie she's not picky when it comes to her food um she eats yam she eats potato she eats um she doesn't she hasn't started eating fufu and banku yet banku she would do maybe one two but i think the texture is a little weird for me so i have to find a way to feed that to her um, without letting her actually feel the texture but that's all part of motherhood that you have to figure out by yourself okay um ain't nobody gonna hand you a manual <laughs> so i have to figure out how to incorporate other meals into her food because she's growing she's almost three um but i feel like also with time she's going to get used to food because that's what we eat as human beings we just eat to survive so um, with time she's obviously going to want more food and you know get tired of the potatoes and the rice um so hopefully with time her eating will you know upgrade in a way that she eats pretty much everything um but yeah i'm just gonna cook something i actually wanted to deep clean my kitchen today i'm not gonna lie i'm wearing a tube top if you're wondering <laughs> um but i should put on some lip gloss but i also can't be bothered right now because i'm home and when i'm home i'm comfortable okay it's the comfort of my house where we pay the bills and so nobody can tell me how to feel at home so i always feel comfortable um except that because i'm coming on camera sometimes i'm a little conscious about it but i'm hoping that you guys are my friends and friends don't have filters okay sometimes we do but not every time so me and you we don't have no filter except if you know it starts to be a problem which is not so um <laughs> i even lost my train of thoughts for it again but what i actually wanted to do today was deep clean my kitchen you know get i feel like i have a lot of junk in my kitchen especially like a lot of cups and plates and um, maybe pots and I also want to clear my counter because if you you guys see my kitchen I have my air fryer my kettle my coffee maker my milk frother <laughs> My my little coffee rack kitchen. Uh, I mean my coffee lazy Susan sitting here uh, My microwave is in the corner like I feel like my thing is so full of appliances and in view of becoming a soft girly um i want a clear counter okay not entirely clear but i want a minimal looking type of counter um because i've also realized that i feel like it's a little clustered like it's it's a lot of stuff so i'm going to clear out cabinet spaces because i have cabinet spaces that i feel like are filled with junky things things that i actually don't need so i will just clear them out and then put some of the appliances down in these counters so that when i need to use them i'll just pull them out 
um, so I can have a nice clean clear counter you know I don't know why but I just want to do it and I'm gonna do it okay so I might do that also today but that's that was the main plan for today but now that I'm about to cook because it's 12 um, I don't know I don't know because time goes by so fast and then before you can say Jack it's like 5 p.m. and you're like oh what did I do today so I don't want to be in that um, situation by the end of the day so I might cook and clean just so that I know that food is sorted out um, and then you know I can just take my time and clean and then edit so yeah but also I have cooked so much with you guys on this vlog this week like from making indomie to what what what's like I've been cooking all over so um, how much cooking can we do on the vlog like how much cooking tutorials can you get in a day right so I'm not gonna be cooking again with you guys but I might um, clean with you for a bit and then um, yeah we can see goodbye to the weekly vlog so yeah I hope you guys are enjoying so far <laughs> just finished cleaning up my counter space and um, the only thing that I was able to take out was the air fryer and the coffee maker I realized that I use this kettle pretty much every day literally every day like to make my best food in the morning and at night and um, the milk frother could go honestly she doesn't need to be here as well so she can also go but this is why I have everything right now. This is why I have everything. I have my coffee maker, I have my toaster, I have the air fryer, I have my juicer. I will also just put my milk frother right there. I realized that I'm the type of girl that likes my coffee out, so I'm not going to lie. Having the coffee here, I'm not so happy about it. Um, but also, I'm like, I don't make coffee every day, you know? I make it every other day or well, sometimes every day if i'm being completely honest um but it's not a problem it's just here i can always take it out i'm just so used to having a coffee station but right now i think having a clear counter space is literally what i want this is exactly what i want everything looks nice and clean and then everything looks like minimal so so everything is just clear my um microwave is still there and then I have my little decor situation here and then uh, my coffee syrups and some sugar and I usually put coffee in those and matcha anything that I have to fill up I could put it in that and then I just have this over here with my um, spoons and whatnot I have to take this back into the office because she's definitely spoiling the aesthetic look at her she's spoiling the whole thing <laughs> okay <laughs> All the other distractions are gone now um, but yeah counter space is clear and I'm happy about it like I am so happy it's nice and clean oh it's actually very nice and clean like it looks very clear you know like not too much appliances I love that if I take the kettle from there as well it's going to make it even better but again I use it every day so I'll just leave it um, but yeah I'm pretty much done with the kitchen right now I'm just gonna go chill for a bit I'm not gonna lie um, we ate before I look crusty <laughs> I look like I just did house chores that's what I look like um, oily and whatever but yeah 
Um, so this part of the house is done. Um, I have to do laundry and then I have to do the bathroom. And then I'm done for the day and I also have to do my hair. So I'm just going to go chill for a bit. United Showbiz is showing right now on UTV. If you don't know what that is, it's a show that um, they show from back home. And we just happen to, you know, keep up with it from here. Because, you know, we're Ghanaian. So we're Ghanaians at heart. So um, I'm just going to go to... I'm just gonna chill, watch that for a second, and then I'll uh, do the other stuff. But for right now, I'm just gonna go chill, take a breather, okay? The kitchen is clean, and that's enough for right now. So, one second. Hey guys! Happy Sunday. Um, it is Sunday, and I am literally here to end off the vlog. I have been filming all day. Well, let me just say, creating content all day. Um, I did a wash day routine for my hair. And then I filmed a get ready with me for my makeup. And then I filmed a TikTok, a talk through TikTok, get dressed with me for the very first time. I think this is the second time, but this time I, I feel like the energy was there this time. The TikTok energy, the vibe was there. So if you don't follow me on TikTok, you better follow me on TikTok right now because you're going to be seeing um, a lot more of the content because today felt very comfortable. So I feel like I will be doing a lot more. But um, I styled this outfit that I'm wearing today. I got it from Amazon. You guys will see it on my Instagram as well. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, please do follow me on Instagram at Akusia Ben Hine and on TikTok at Akusia Ben Hine. Any other social media platform is still my name, Akusia Ben Hine. I also have a new episode of the Bed with Ben Hine podcast, which went up yesterday. Actually, went up this morning, Sunday, this morning. So. Um, also check that out I will leave a link for that down below but I want to say thank you guys so much for watching this week's vlog I am so grateful for all of you guys and for the nice comments you know the new subscribers that are joining I see all of you okay I see all of you and I'm grateful for all of you but thank you guys so much for watching this week's vlog bye oh the short hair's out who am i like the short hair's out i forgot to acknowledge that but the short hair is out i think i might be wearing my hair out for the rest of the week i do not know don't hold me on that okay or don't quote me on that but um i don't know whatever happens we'll see you next week's vlog but yeah bye